Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvania toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time. People. And we got some random figures to review because the new week of reviews came so quickly, I was surprised at how quickly it came. Because it already, it's already June already. Wow. Time flies, if you know what I mean. But we're going to be reviewing some random figures here from my pile up here. First on the list, we're going to be reviewing brand new is the Jack Specific Sonic the Hedgehog Silver, which I did not have in my personal collection. I found this at Rite Aid for 6 bucks, and I picked it up because it was the very last one. Sonic the Hedgehog Silver, Jack Specific. A bio about Silver, if you want to read it, and the other figures in the line, like Sonic, Knuckles, Shadow, uh, Chaos Control Shadow. That's all there is to say for that package, and let's look at Silver himself. Some decent articulation on this 25-inch action figure. He can kick out that far, kick back that far. Head is on a swivel, no ball joint, which is a real letdown. Other than that, he's a good figure. I'd highly recommend him. Next on the old school list, we got an old school Iron Man that I got from Steel City Con. He's got bend at the knee, which is nice. I love the bends at the knee. Hinge joint, hinge joint. Bend at the elbow, nice. Head is on a tight ball joint. He's got an ab crunch for an old school figure. He's got an ab crunch. Other than that, he's a cool looking Iron Man and is going in my random Marvel shelf for sure. Next on the list, we got something I got for clearance. And this is from Jurassic World. And I got this for clearance for five bucks. It was originally ten bucks, but I got this for five bucks. So I got my first ever pterodactyl for my Jurassic World collection. Articulation, the head is on a swivel. Mouth opens up, so you might eat you or something. Hinge joints for the legs. Ball joints for the arms, but very tight. And that's all there is to say for the package in for that figure. But it's a really nice figure. I love it. And that's all there is to say for the Jurassic World figure I picked up. And now he's going on the shelf with the other dinosaurs. My dinosaurs. My own Jurassic Park themed collection. Next on the list is something I got from eBay from 2012. TMNT. Shredder. And I've wanted me a good looking Shredder for my collection for a while now. Now for comparison, here is Shredder. Next to my custom foot soldier. And of course, a newer class, slightly newer class, Turtles figure. It is the Rise, the Ninja Turtles Paper Foot Soldier. You're probably wondering, where did I get these figures? A cup, one of these I got from eBay. Other one I got from Rite Aid. Other one I got from the convention. And the last one I got from Dollar General. I would highly recommend you pick up these figures if you're a figure collector like myself. I love picking up some Marvel, some Sonic, some Turtles from time to time, and some Jurassic Park as well. That's all there is to say for this video. This is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.